是破皮破皮破皮破，开帕萨萨帕西，我得读。Welcome to Crime Time News, where the difference is in the meds. Call it news with a buzz. Now, people, I am sure that you've probably heard the many horror stories about the legend of Bigfoot, how he has stepped in many men's life and mash up the people and love relationship, kind of like Nico. And I am sure that you've probably heard that he has trampled on many persons' gongo walk because of his stamina, daddy, bedroom bully, bedwork sensation. He is usually better than mana yard. He is the minister of work, while you are probably the minister of finance. But I am sure that you've never seen him get caught. With his hand in at the cookie jar, or him tongue in at the p u m s, or probably laying down in at the bed beside your bestie, meaning your wife. So therefore, your wife could be Joe Grant's b i t c h, better yet, sidekick. However, people, I am here to tell you the stories that you've heard. It is not a myth. Bigfoot is actually live and in living color. So, therefore, I am going to show you a video. This is a video of Joe Grant being caught by Mana Yard. When Joe Grant is caught, the wife, our baby mother, our whatever she's called, she is defending Joe Grant. She is saying that Joe Grant came to feed the chicken. However, people. In this video, the chickens almost came to roost. This lady is actually defending Joe Grant. Her stories are very inconsistent. She claims that Joe Grant come to feed the chicken. However, there was no source of chicken in the coop, so therefore Joe Grant was more like the fox that came to name the chicken. Joe Grant did not come to paint any place. Him come to paint the wife fence. So I want you to take a listen to the reaction of the girlfriend, wife, whoever, the reaction of Joe Grant, which is not much, and then the reaction of the husband, the minister of finance, as he caught the minister of work in a in place. Take a listen, take a look, and then I'll give my piece. Hmm. How are you? Mm -hmm. you, so you're there with my wife? Which wife? I work. Yeah. You come to come and say, I work. And I'm named Bunny. And I'm named Bunny. So why not go hide? Why not hide? Feed chicken. No chicken. No dung. So why not feed? How far chicken them? So why not do chicken now? I feed chicken them. How are you? I'm going to ask you. How are you? What's your name? No, you is who, sir? No, I'm not. No, I'm just saying. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm just saying. What's your name, sir? Yeah, there, yeah, just where, where, where your name? Where there with my wife, do? You really try it. Well, easy, no? Me yes, not me, do nothing. What for you, sir? Tell me, not doing nothing. Oh, yeah, oh. Mr. King. Oh, Mr. King. Are King. Oh, your name Bunny King? Okay. So, Good. so nobody can go in a me do nothing. Oh, you might help you do nothing. You know, you know, take, you know, my video, sir? Are your name Bunny? Me ask you for your name Bunny. Is your name Bunny, sir? Hold oh. on, me attack. Hold on, Tamar. Where, where you came with? So what name? Why, why, why name? What is his name? What is his name? What is his name? Eh? Okay, so you're there with my wife, not you? It's All along me I hear about it. Now is the time. Miss you. Okay. Yeah man. Me, me, me just want to know say, are you? Mr. King. In Tamar. In, uh, this is the yard though. Leo. This is what you're here doing. Wait, 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 give me. Well, last I got being give me dollar. Listen. I'm going to spray. No, no, no. Spray. 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 Oh. Yeah. Spray. Oh, no. James, so your phone. Come take your picture, man, man. Yeah. All right. You know, you could lie down, sit down. Now, people, after watching this very disturbing video that could have went way, way left, it is obvious what they say is true. Silent rivers run deep. So we see, say, the minister of work, he is not much about talking 
him not have nothing to say. He might take the fifth. He knows that he is guilty as sin. He knows that he was caught red-handed. How deep was he going like them say? Still rivers run deep. It seems as if him up in at the people and woman place. Wherever that is. And the man was confused. Meaning the husband. A who him. The wife was saying that he came to work. However what type of work. Bed work sensation that is. The man came to feed the chicken. The man came for paint. Him come for spray. He was doing everything. It seems as if he is Mr. All Purpose. Jack of all trade. But master none. However, he is the master of the husband's domain. So people, this shows you that the hired hand pretty much got caught with his hand R-M-C-O-C-K-Y in the wife. I am not going to say mouth. You know exactly what I am speaking about. This man has no sorts of name. However, he has a whole bunch of fame. He is the myth. He is the legend. He is Joe Grind. However, in this case, this man's name is Mr. Bunny King. So people, just based on what we've heard in the video, it is obvious that the wife, girlfriend, Tamara, she is guilty of sin. And people, this is a sin that is being perpetuated all over Jamaica. It has been going on for decades. And this tells you why there are so much jacket. So much youth, boys and girls, born today. And the man that they thought was their father is not their father. There is no sorts of resemblance. Not even the con upon them too. So Tamara is found guilty as sin. And people, what did Tamara say when they found her? Guilty, caught her red-handed. She said to the man, what have you done for me lately? People, can you imagine? You come home to your wife. You are not a two minutes man and even if you are, you are a provider. However, it seems as if you are not really giving the wife what she wants. You are giving her the two minutes and you are not giving her enough financial compensation. You know, not give her the rook and bind, and you know, not give her the old time wine. You are not giving her nothing but all sorts of promises. So my point is this. When you assess or analyze cheating in the terms of economics, it is called supply and demand. The women out there want what they want. They want that bedwork sensation. They want that finance. Sometimes the minister of finance is different from the minister of works. So therefore they come in where they fit in. However, sometimes the minister of finance, he is kind of upset with the whole situation. Especially when he thought that this lady, this woman is my wife, my sole girlfriend. She's not hanging around getting played getting tapped on by any other stranger and then he finds out he is going to be disappointed because he thought that she was loyal however people the truth and the fact is that the fact that there are so much jacket out there in a jamaica it tells you that somebody has been cheating a whole bunch of persons have been cheating and if you think because you have the longest tongue you have the longest schlong However, you don't have any sorts of finance. She might also cheat. Vice versa. So therefore, this man learned a very hard lesson. Him learned the hard way. However, Tamara is very lucky that this man does not have the temperament. Does not flare up whenever him get in a, any sorts of jealous R-A-G-E. He was pretty much talking. Had this man be the average man in a Jamaica, based on all the stories that we've heard, more than likely Tamara and Joe Grind would have had to be running for their life.
people would have probably get C-H-O-P-P-E-D up in a fine, fine pieces and dash way in a sea. And people, I am not saying that. That is the right thing to do. And it is justifiable. But just as I say, that is what usually happens in this case. However, this man was kind of calm under the circumstances under F-I-R-E. Point blank and period. Further on in the news, it is confirmed that the craziest dunces drivers on the road live in Jamaica. I am going to show you an incident or A-C-C-I-D-E-N-T in which at least four or five vehicles that were damaged because of one man that obviously cannot drive, don't have any sorts of driver's license and even worse, don't have any sorts of common sense. This incident was said to have taken place at a place called Peachan Street. I think that that is downtown. Take a listen, take a look to the edited version and then I am going to give my piece. This is an accident right off um, Peachan Street. Peachan Street. I mean, this boy, the cart went into the air and just turned over. Some of my students were in it. But trust me, it's, it's nasty. <laughs> This man is being arrested. Man is being arrested here and he has no license and the car is not insured. So people, based on the information that I am getting, the purses in the vehicle that flip over there are some students from Walmart's, Walmart's High School. The cabman or the man was running from the popo. He does not have any sorts of driver's license. So that kind of explains, not justify why he was running. But that is the case. No sorts of license. Trying to avoid the popo. However, because of his negligence, because of his selfish act, people almost lose their life. People can get mashed up. So not only persons get injured, also a whole bunch of cars associated with insurance. A whole bunch of people have to make alternative choices or alternative ways to get around because of this man's deed. People, it makes absolutely no sorts of sense. So therefore it started from a chase, turn to people, almost lose them life, turn to him getting arrested eventually which he deserves point blank and period so anyways people thanks once again for checking out my video if you appreciate videos like these please show your appreciation by liking commenting sharing and subscribing to my channel that is how youtube promotes videos like these to like-minded sensible persons like yourself bless up